as it is rightly said never take your eyes off the cash flow because it's the lifeblood of business it is very important to track your cash flow right from day one and believe me if you fail to maintain your cash flows you will soon be into a big mess although you might be making profits but you will never see the money in your bank account if you don't maintain the cash flows you will not know where is the money going you will not have a track of the money you earn thus right from the first day that is right from today you need to start maintaining a cash flow sheet in fact you should also be adding the amount you paid for this course in the money outwards column as this is the first investment you have made towards starting your own preschool i want you to download the cash flow template after this session and start maintaining it from the day when you make your first investment towards your preschool setup please maintain the sheet regularly even if you are spending rupees 100 or rupees 1 lakh do not fail to add this amount in the cash flow sheet at the end of every day spend at least 20 minutes on this cash flow sheet and make all the necessary entries here's how the cash flow sheet looks like this is a very basic and a user friendly cash flow sheet that i have made you can definitely customize the same as per your requirement now when you start maintaining the cash flow sheet you will see a lot of benefits number 1 you will have clarity at any given point if you see the sheet you will have a complete clarity on how much you have spent and how much you have earned you will be able to discipline yourself and stop spending on unnecessary expenses the cash flow sheet will help you to stick to the roi sheet your life will be much easy with no stress of managing the funds you will have a clear picture of how much money you have in your bank account how much would be your operational cost for the coming month what amount you can expect in the next month in terms of the school fees etc well i'm sure you have clarity in terms of how to maintain a cash flow sheet and why to maintain it let's move on to the next session where i will help you out in identifying a property for your preschool and further also talk about the basics that you need in terms of developing the preschool infrastructure